Hi there, Artemis Cantalides, co-owner of Iron Body Studios in Boston, Mass. I'm here again going through seven safe training tips for the Turkish getup. This is number two. So number two is how do you pick up the bell when you're, you're setting up for your getup? You want to be on the side, bring it close to your body, okay? So lying on your side, in the fetal position, or some of you don't like that term, um, just having your, your knees close to your body. Really cuddle up with your belt, okay? <laughs> Get comfy with your belt. As I said in step one, you want to find that corner that's closest to your shoulder. Take some time to get that bell handle low in the heel of your hand. Both hands on the bell. I don't care how much that bell weighs. This is just a 12 kilogram bell, but you want to treat it like your max weight with the get up. Like you want to treat it like a 48 kilogram bell, 106 pound bell. So both hands on that bell, no matter what the weight, one hand over the other, you're going to bring it in. Aim to bring it in towards your stomach. That does not mean lean it on your stomach. It means you want to bring it up and in towards your stomach. And then you'll see here, in, when I'm in position, I have a vertical forearm, okay? I'm not leaning my forearm on my stomach. Vertical forearm, like I'm going to go into doing a floor press, a chest press, okay? So both hands on the bell, taking my time, bell handle, low in the heel of my hand, deep in the crease of between my thumb and forefinger, bring it in, vertical forearm, you'll see that both of my hands are still on the bell. When I go to press the bell up, no matter what the weight is, I'm going to press it with both hands. Press it with both hands nice and safely, and then I may even take a little bit of time to maneuver that bell around just to make sure it's exactly where I want it to be in this hand before I get started with my gap. So that's number two, stay tuned for number three.